Well, once again, it is so great to be in the house of the Lord and to be able to start yet another Sunday morning with two baptisms. Uh, isn't it cool what God is doing here at First Baptist Church Stockdale? Man, God has been moving in our church uh, through Vacation Bible School, through just Sunday mornings. I mean, we've seen people responding uh, and so uh, the first person that we're going to baptize is Easton West, so I'm going to invite Easton down. Easton is one of the children. You can hop up there on that bridge. Easton's one of the children that gave his life to Christ during vacation Bible school, and then he made that public last week as he came forward at the end of the service, uh, and then already ready to get baptized today and a uh, cool thing just like last week it's his birthday oh. so i was telling him uh back there as we were getting ready that uh, this is going to be special because every year you'll get to remember on your birthday as you celebrate your birthday that this was also the day that you made your faith in christ public through baptism and so, Easton, I ask you, before your friends, before your family, before this church body, is Jesus your Lord? Yes. Amen. All right. Easton, it's because of your public profession of faith in Jesus Christ. I baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. You're buried with Christ in baptism, raised to walk in the of Christ. And I'm going to turn things over to Palmer because he's got a youth to baptize. Thank you. You got to take your time so you don't slip. <laughs> well, my name's Palmer Jones. I'm the youth minister here. And it's just so exciting just to see what God, I know Kevin already said it, but it's so exciting to see what God is doing in our church. Um, not in all the ministries, right? And so I'm going to invite Caitlin down to join me. Okay, I come yet? Perfect. All right. So Caitlin, this is uh, this is so exciting. Uh, Caitlin's story is such a cool one uh, because she showed up uh, to our uh, Wednesday nights, and uh, she hasn't left. <laughs> she, <laughs> She showed up just one random Wednesday. Uh, we didn't have anything special going on. And, uh, and she heard the gospel preached. And it was on our worship and water balloons night. Uh, for those who don't know, we just had, uh, we sang about five or six worship songs. And then afterwards, we went to that field and we chunked water balloons at each other for the last 45 minutes. And it was a lot of fun. But it was that night uh, that I, I didn't even preach or give a message that she went to Pastor Kevin and said, I, I want to follow Christ. Amen. And I just think that's so cool. Just to show, guys, church, do not get discouraged when you share the gospel and you don't see immediate fruits. That that seed is planted, that on a night the gospel wasn't even presented, so to speak. We st Caitlin still came to salvation. And that is just such a beautiful thing that that seed grew. And so I'm so excited to be here with you today. And she's excited to make her faith public before her church family. And so with that, Caitlin, I want to ask you, is Jesus your Lord? Yes. Amen. 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 All right. Well, Caitlin, based on your public profession of faith, it is, your, it is my honor and privilege as your brother in Christ to baptize you in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. <laughs> in the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit. Buried with Christ in baptism. <laughs> and raised to walk in the name of the Son. 